What is going on YouTube? My name is Keg and welcome back to another episode of Forza Horizon 3. This is episode number 3 and as you can see I have got myself a shiny new BMW M4. I have come to Service Paradise. I got my festival up to level 2. There's heaps of new stuff that's open. Bought myself a new BMW. Got myself uh, waypointed to this undiscovered PR stunt. This is the first time driving the M4. So let's give it a go. We had the Dart Hemi before this. We did one race with that one. Uh, it needed a fifth gear desperately. It was just on the limiter in fourth gear every single time. Uh, it desperately needed another gear. So hopefully this M4 is just as quick because the other car, it was quick. But we've got heaps and heaps and heaps of stunts. Uh, heaps and heaps and heaps of events to do, rather. Uh, and this one here is going to be a uh, PR stunt, so... Let's see what that one is. Oh, sorry, Van. I'm sorry. Man, this thing's quick. It's really quick. 3.4k to go. Love driving through surface. It just looks so good. I should probably get on the correct side of the road. Turn right. Yeah, it drifts okay. That was second gear, I mean. Doesn't drift that good. I don't know, maybe it's got too much grip. Often you get those cars that just have too much grip, especially these model ones, and they just don't want to slide. Oh, please don't turn right. Ah, what are you doing? That was so lucky. What was he doing? What was his goal there? To die? Because I'm pretty sure he was about to achieve his goal. And one car away, that was quick. This car is definitely quick. I like this car. I like the angle. So I'm currently in Service Paradise. I don't know when I should start going back to the other festival. Or if I should just level up my Service Paradise festival first. Can I drive straight through here? Yeah, I can. Cool. Okay. Difficulty medium. I think all the other ones so far have been easy. So we'll see how this one is. Experience Australian Magnus and HSV Maloo. I had a Maloo. That was the one I was driving at the start. Do I need to go for another drive? In the rain, on dirt? Wow. Get to the drift zone, and I missed the rest of it. Race to the drift zone and smash the target, okay. So am I meant to be drifting? Yeah, I am meant to be drifting. Let's see there's drift points in the door. <laughs> wow, this is crazy. Okay, so I need to get 25,000 drift points. You cannot go full throttle on this thing around a corner because it will just rotate. It will not come back. It's hard enough just going in these little corners. Come on, can I get some drift score up, please? I uh, get a little bit. I don't know if I should be in third. I feel like it doesn't have enough room in third. Yeah, it's going all right. Nah, it just doesn't spin as much as I would want it to in third. Okay, I've got a minute 12 left. Whoops. That just steps out like crazy. At least it pulls up quick. The brakes are awesome. Is that it? Did I just fail that massively? I didn't make it. That's an understatement. I was nowhere near that 25,000 point target. But I still had heaps of time. I had like over a minute. Can I turn around and keep going as long as I've got time? It seems I can do it. I can do that. Okay, let's start it. Spamming the A button. It does nothing. Let's go. We got it this time. Exploring it. No mercy. 25,000. Alright. We'll just try it in second. Let's see how we go. I've taken out this dude's wheelie bins already. Probably should have used a the handbrake there. We'll just keep it in second. On to the handbrake again. Cutting the corner a bit. Not as much of a drift as I'd want. But at least it's better than last time. Maintain the drift so it keeps the points up. And then don't oversteer too much as we're coming to this one. Second gear is a lot better. Yeah, second gear is a lot better. Nope, couldn't carry that. Damn, I need to carry that. Oh, it's still going. Good. Thank God. Yes, use A while turning to handbrake drift. I got it. Come on. It's still not going to be enough. Not going to be enough. Damn. I didn't even see how many points I was getting. I think I was on a three times multiplier with about 4,000 points. So just over half. I'm only just over half. Wow. Man. 
I need to do almost double as many points. Okay, let's do it. I want to do too many guys, more guys of this, but I know I can get this. 25 more points. I know I can get this. Let's do it. Oh, it just bogs down in second straight away. I got no points for that. That was alright. That sucked, getting no points for that one. I thought for sure I'd get points for that. Come on, more drift. More drift. More drift. On the e-brake there, or as we call it. Because, you know, you use your hand for it. And again on the e-brake. It's not sliding as much as I want it to. Drift zone. Oh, is this where I'm meant to get 25,000 points? Well, there's 25,000 points in the drift zone, but I don't... Oh, no. I just lost all that. Are you kidding? Oh, my God. I'm going to edit that out. Everyone, look away. Look away. You're not meant to see that. Look away. Maybe that's what I wanted me to do. Did I actually get it? Yeah, I did. Okay. <laughs> all right. That was terrible. So, running into the tree there, that was the key that I needed to do. I didn't run into the tree the first time. And so it didn't give me the victory. Come on, McLaren. Give it to me. Nope. There it goes. Oh. 20,000 credits. Is that all? That's good. A few more fans. According to Kira, or whatever the chick's name is, fans are the single most important thing in my entire life. So lucky we're getting fans. Lucky we are getting them. All right. Am I back in my M4 or am I stuck back in the loop? Hopefully we're back in my M4. Because I only just got that car, and I like that car. Yeah. All right, cool. Let's go to... Let's do another one. Let's... Oh, what's this one? That one looks pretty cool. Let's do that one. All right, screw you using the road. Nah, I'll be right. We're just going to bush bash. We're not going to use that road. Oh, I need to go to the right. And to the right we are. Watch out, tree. Oh. Wet road. I love the weather effects in this game, I, and I love how it makes the cars feel. When it rains, when it's sunny, after the rain when the road's still wet, it is so great. Really, really impressed with the weather effects in this game, and the graphics. I can't stress that enough. Well, can we pull up? This guy's had an accident. What are you doing there, buddy? You okay? Yeah, he's alright. Man, this thing barely wants to spin the tyres in first in the wet. That's a bit sad. Let's go up here. Go through this guy's backyard. I know I need to be over here somewhere. Please mind the trees. Nope. Got it. At least I'm still going in the generally the right direction. Oh yeah, there's the roundabout. And dodge trees, dodge trees, dodge trees. Big tree. Where are we going? We're going out left, go left. Oh, trees. Nice. I think we made it. Yes. We made it. Probably wasn't that much quicker in the end turn. Probably wasn't. Ah! Any quicker in the end. But we made it. Can I just go up to the right here? More trees. This is it. This is where we need to be. That was perfect. That was a great shortcut. This was looking awesome. I bet you I can't go through that. I can. Whoops. I thought I was going to smash straight into those bits of wood. Apparently you can just go straight through them. Awesome. This event looks like it's going to be fun. Do I need to be on the roof? Nope, I don't need to be on the roof. Alright, what is this one? Deconstruct the construction site in the Ford RS200. Nice. Alright, so I assume we're going for damage. Beat the skills target. Man, that was... Flat to the floor. What do I need to do? I don't. Am I just following this track? I don't think I'm meant to. Alright, I've got 2 minutes 17 to do skill points. Alright. How do I get skill points? But just by doing that? Wow, this thing is quick. It does not want to stay, stay in a straight line. Okay, is that. Oh, yeah, cool. Yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting points. Whoa. Watch out, wall. Come on, let's go. Let's do a jump. Surely that'll give me some points. I didn't mean to do that jump. I meant to do this jump. 
Do I just lose my windshield? No. Uh, more damage, bit of drifting. Just damage gives me points? No. I've only got 2,400 points so far. Alright, I've got to figure out how to get some more points. Drift does it. How about the jump? Oh, I lost it all. Okay. <clears throat> I need to sort out what I'm doing with my life here. Maybe just drive around for a bit. Because like, I've only got a minute 19 left. Maybe I should just drive. And I seem to be getting a fair few more points up now just by driving. Which is pretty cool. I can just drive anywhere along here. But hey, have some points. You drove. Well done. Have some extra points. Have some more points. Can I jump off here? Sort of. <gasps> Don't hit it. Oh, I thought I was going to lose all my points then. What's up here? Uh, not a lot is up here. There's a ramp that's going to put me straight back up here. You know what? It's going to... I'm just going to collect these points. I'm just going to... I've got 35 seconds left. I'm assuming if I sit still, it's just going to let me collect all these points. Because that should give me enough. Can we please collect? Yeah, nice. 95,000 points. I'll slide the other. What? <laughs> he just drove off the edge. And all that happened is he broke the headlight. <laughs> oh, that one was pretty cool. I enjoyed that one. That was a good one. Those PR stunts are fun. Because you get to drive around in a different car and do weird stuff like that. Would just drive around. That was cool. All right, let's do one more race before we wrap up this video. Let's do an actual race. So we know that's a stunt. Uh, three bridge circuit. How about... Undiscovered route. Let's go an undiscovered route. Let's do that one. Turn All right. Around. Yeah, I'm going to jump off here with a fair bit of pace. But I know that I need to go in this direction. Slightly left. Please don't let there be anything. Wow, almost hit that truck. Uh, we're just going to get through all this and try and dodge some trees. Trees, trees, trees. Cool. Missed them all. Let's get back down the road. Yes. Yeah, so right now, with what is this car doing? Oh, you never know with these cars. You don't know if they're just going to ramp. Whoa, that was solid. I was about to say, you don't know if those cars are just going to ram into you or what. Just cross on the opposite side of the road for absolutely no reason and just into you. I learned that these guardrails are solid not to drive into them. Because there's tons of stuff that's destructible and I can just play out through it, but guardrails are not one of them. Okay, 2.3k. I mean, all these guys are just obeying traffic laws. Some of these guys, some of the drivers that just pull straight out in front of you and want to kill you, I mean, others just are happy to obey the traffic laws. It's funny. All right, 260. Man, this thing's really moving. I'm not even in six. 275Ks an hour. Some pulls. All right, we're back into the city of Service Paradise. Oh, the, yeah, I guess sure, city corner. See what this race is. Hopefully, it'll be a good one. Whoops, sorry, buddy. This one's a sprint. A point sprint. A point B on sealed roads. Go get him. All right. Let's do a cross city sprint. Yep. We'll take the M4. Enjoying this thing so far. So we'll keep with it. And I think it should be good for a sprint. I think the M4 is probably a good choice. I could could have chosen the M3. Um, I think I want to get that car a little bit later on and put some modifications on it. But as a fairly stock standard car, the M4 is is where it's at. It's good. All right, looks like a lot of tough competition. Um, I saw some. Yeah, I see some Jags. I see some Beamers. All right, let's get into it. All right, so zero percent progress. That's so just A to B. Into ninth. These cars are so quick. They are all just destroying me. Let's see how we go in the corners. Can we not slide? Can we not hit that tree? Nope, we can hit that tree. This thing loves to slide. I've found a lot of the cars in this game so far like to slide. You really need to be early on the brakes or you just ram into people. Am I going to get in trouble for missing that checkpoint? Yes, I am. Saw that one coming. I missed it by too much. Too busy trying to ram into people is what I was doing. I'm trying to cheat my way up the ladder. Like that. 
kind of like that. I would like a few more positions there. We'll see if we can get another one. No. How solid are telegraph poles are? I imagine pretty solid. Can you not do that, car? Oh no, I can cut down telegraph poles. Alright, we're up into eight. Quarter of the way there. I need some more people that I can use the corner. It's handling a lot better now. I think I've just gotten used to it. Not. Oh, I had to say something, didn't I? We lost the position there just because of the way I was driving. I had to say something. Oh, we got the position back because he's not very fast. I think it must be just a normal M3. Stop sliding! Jeez. I'm... Oh, thanks. That's cool. I don't know why you wanted to push me into the wall there. Because you're on unbeatable difficulty. But anyway. We might as well redo this corner. So I just need to brake a little bit earlier. I think I'm braking a little bit too late. It's causing me to slide a fair bit. So we'll brake a little bit earlier. Yeah, it's a bit better. A little bit better. Wow, it's a limiter right on red line. It's not going to see that. All right, let's go, let's go. I need to start catching some of these guys. Man, this other beamer is just right on my tail. I've got the power though to get past him. But I do not have the power to catch these next guys. Uh, okay, that was pretty clean. Happy with that. And that was good as well. I feel like these are relatively clean corners, and I should be catching the people in front of me, but I'm just not. Maybe they aren't as clean as what I thought. 75%. We are very, very close to the end here, and I'm still in 8. So I have no hope of winning this one. Especially with corners like that. He just went straight past me. I was sitting still. Wow, that Lexus is quick. I don't know why he was breaking there. But he is quick. I should be able to catch this beamer before the end, but it's not going to matter because I'm not fast. Wow. Didn't even catch him. Got ninth. That is not first. And as a requirement of this series, I need to be first. That's one of the basic requirements of this series. You need to place first keg. Ninth. It's approximately, I don't have my calculator on me, but it's approximately eight positions away from first. So let's see how we go this time. We'll be a little bit more aggressive at the start, try and make up a couple of positions. One is at the start where we can just kind of ram our way through a bit. Do a bit of the naughty, but there's so many cars that are fast. That Lexus is quick, that Mercedes is quick. This Jaguar next to me is faster than me in a straight line. And he enjoys ramming me in the corners. Oh man, not good. Get out of the way! No, no need for brakes there. Sorry, metal. Yep, yeah, there was need for brakes there. I'll take that back. There was definitely need for brakes there. Man, my tires are smoky as. Whoops. I, I, I really didn't mean to do that. Let's go. A little bit. Dude, you don't need to be braking that much. 78%. This is the rundown of the. The finish line. Please send me that counter. Please send me that counter. It didn't. Oh, I'm so close. I'm so close. That was... I think I need to touch the checkpoint flag with my car. Definitely wasn't close to that. I think I need to be on the inside of this corner in order to catch them at the end here. As they disappear. There is no other way to describe it. They are disappearing into the horizon. Ha! Get it for the horizon. Uh, they just go and go. Nope. I need to be in front of them. I need to get in front of them on this corner. I need to at least go up the inside of this white car. Which I'm not doing. What is that car out in front? Where is... Okay. I can't see what's out in front. But anyway. Oh, man, it doesn't even matter. Holy crap. Look how much I'm getting overtaken by everyone. Can I slipstream at least? Try and catch this guy. Oh, can I get him at the end? Nah. Third place. Damn. What is it? It's the same as me. They're both M4s, but the thing just takes off. They just disappear. 
Whoa, why is he breaking? Come on. You can break too. Oh, so close. Second place. Screw it. Second place against an R Audi RS4. That will do. Man, I played that a lot. Second is not first. I am well aware of that. I can see it in the comment section already. I will go back. I will complete this race on first. Uh, sure. Yeah, sure. I'll like it. I will get that race done on first. Definitely. As that's annoying me that I could only get second. Oh, man. I did it so many times, though. So, so many times. Heaps of times. I should go and find, do some of these farm finds, too. Okay. Where am I at? Let's have a look at the map. I'm not sure if I'm out of the city at all. Alright, guys. That'll do it for this video. Thank you very much for joining me on this episode. On this, uh... On this struggling, struggling to get first and just settling with second for now. Episode of Fortress Horizon 3. In the next episode, we will continue on in our Service Paradise Festival. And at some point, I need to come back down here and keep doing more of my Byron Bay Festival. And certainly, I'll look up, well, I'll go and have a look for the barn finds and see if we can find some cool cars. But uh, that will do it for this episode, guys. As always, subscribe for more videos. Like the video if you like the video. And we'll see you in the next one.